that you guys i just had like the epic time i get my tripod after it's hot i mean out of its hiding spot but i had like the most trying time trying to take off my bed i did the laundry um even though like i just did it i needed to do it again because like that so far i watched that um comforter set like that new oh, why am i talking to you guys i could just put you on the tripod hold on sorry i realized that like i don't even need to hold you guys in my hand i could just put you on the tripod um so i took off the my blanket whatever i took my blanket off the bed because it was just too much like all right it's gonna be a little gross for you guys but, but um i what was i doing in the back oh i was doing like uh like a face mask doing a face mask like that turmeric scrub thing i was doing that and it's like in the cubby hole why am i explaining it so long like and recently something just told me to look down so i looked down and the toilet seat not on the actual like toilet but on like the outer ring was like some blue stuff blue stuff i kid you not it was like ink and I don't sleep in like full on long johns, you know what I mean? So it's like on my skin. And I'm not gonna show you something because I just did it. And I'm just like really annoyed because like that means my whole body is covered in like that ink stuff. Actually, I don't know if I wanna show you guys because it is kind of gross. Do you see the blue? Do you see the blue? There's like blue stuff all over. And I look, all right, so this, this is a clean one, right? I'm gonna do it on this arm, this one wipe, or maybe two wipes. Do you see the blue stuff? Oh no, trust me, there's blue stuff. Oh my God, it won't even show. All right, maybe it needs to be darker. I'm just gonna wipe all over me. Oh, there we go. Do you see the blue stuff? There's blue stuff, I, and this looks like there's water on it, but I kid you not, there's like blue stuff on here, okay? All right, so I washed my blanket set, and since I got it, I washed it two times um, already, well since, not when I got it, because I had it for a while. Since the first time I washed it and put it on my bed, I've washed it in a total two times. But, like, every time the color would fade and fade and fade. So, it's not so fed up. I took it, even though I washed it, like, a couple of days ago. I took it off my bed, and I just put it in a washing machine downstairs. I put, um, like, three Tide Pods in there. I mean, it's normal, I guess. But I put it on heavy. And I never like need to put my clothes and stuff on heavy because like this is normal wash. Like I feel like heavy is when like you wore it down, you know? Like it smells, there's like oil stains, stuff like that. That's the only time you I use heavy. But yeah, it's just it's annoying to me. I I, I should take a shower now, but um I know I'd be sweating and stuff like that. So I'm gonna wait to take a shower. I'm gonna wait till I put everything back on my bed. And then I want to cook dinner. I want to cook some pork chops, you guys. Honestly, that's a little crazy. <laughs> it's a little crazy. I have this on my head because, like, your girl's looking a little rough under here. Yep, it's looking a little rough. I tried to put it in a ponytail, and I realized that I can't go in a ponytail <laughs> because my hair is so short. Now my hair is like up to here and up to here now, but the back is still shorter than the front. So the front is up here, but the back is like neck height. <laughs> Um, I don't know if you guys can, can you guys see? Whatever, I'm roasting some broccoli in there, you can't see. But I want, but I'm roasting some broccoli and I took out the sweet potatoes, I roasted the day before yesterday, yesterday actually, yesterday. And I'm still waiting for my bread to get all, oh, it's almost there. I'm waiting for it to get all hard so I can start cutting it down and make croutons with it. Um, I took out some pork chops that I want to like cook up and eat. But the thing is, I'm gonna have pork chops with like roasted um, broccoli and sweet potato. But like on another another note is like, that sounds like a lot. <laughs> like if you knew me, I need rice. I'm the type of person that like I could just, well you guys know, I can just eat bowls of just like rice. That, that is me. But I be having like these moments where like I don't want rice. Not that I don't want it, it's just like the effort it takes to put or to cook rice. As like you think it's not so much effort until you wash it like four times because it's still not clean, you know? That's the type of psycho I am. Like the water has to run clear, okay? Clear, crystal clear. So also on a side note, you guys know I'm going through the whole 
in vitro fertilization process. Oh, okay. These are some biggins. I don't know if the bone on. Here's the pork chop. Okay. Why did I do it like this? Literally, there's butcher uh, freezer paper, right? Butcher freezer paper, nothing else. No, maybe I ran out of plastic wrap or something. I don't know. I don't know why I did that. That's ridiculous. That's <laughs> ridiculous. I'm like upset at myself. Like maybe I was out of it and I just needed to preserve it. I don't know. And I always wash my meat. So these are like already pre-washed. I just have to like season it up. Ugh. It's gonna be like a random video. I know. Oh, uh, now like I'm a psycho that like I feel my skin is itchy. I'm breaking it out. I mean, I am breaking out, but you know, what's new? I break out all the time. Um, what else am I gonna put on my chops? Ooh, some onion powder. I should have garlic powder. You know, ever since my sister was like, oh, I don't have black people seasoning in my house, I was like, what do you mean? And like, legit, now I cook with it. That's what I reach for. Like, like Larry seasoning salt, onion powder, um, onion powder, garlic powder. I think that's like an every person thing. I don't think it's a black person thing, you know? And like pepper. She said I got pepper, but like, now I kind of want like garlic powder. So I don't have garlic, I just have garlic flakes. Side note, I've been hearing like this neighbor play music and I can only hear it through my clock. Like, hold on, scratchy, scratchy. I can only hear it through my closet, like my clothes closet. And it's kind of like, they'll play like 30 seconds of a song and then I right, cut. And then like a couple hours later, another 30 seconds of a song, you know? I have to put on my apron, you guys. Oh, I didn't preheat the oven. Crap. All right. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to cook them both on both sides, the pork chops, and then put it in the oven. <laughs> That's how I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna fry them on both sides and put it in the oven. And then I'm gonna like half one of these potatoes and put them in there. It just needs to be warmed up. It doesn't need to be cooked again, but I'm thinking about turning it into like, a. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I'm thinking about turning them into like like mashed potatoes, but like sweet mashed potatoes. I don't know yet. Ooh, I have pears too. So if I make sweet mashed potatoes, I have pears in it. <gasps> no, too much work. Never mind. Okay, so it's so all cooking away on there, and I just mixed up my broccoli. I really just want to take a shower. You have no idea, and I have like another 20 minutes before I take out my clothes. Uh, I just don't want to take a shower and then have to like go out the apartment to do stuff like the germ outside germ still on me I know it makes no sense. I mean it kind of makes sense. I mean it makes sense to me obviously But like like then I'm gonna have to wash my feet again. It's like it's a whole thing. <gasps> Wait, I didn't show you hold on This is the new carpet. Sorry, George. Why are you doing that? This is the new carpet They're not doing um $17 kind of $17 quality maybe even 10 I would say I don't know if you find a good discount store you need this for 10 I guess but yep you know what oh my god it's, smoking it's so, so weird to me how like it is literally smoking so much in my apartment but my um fire alarm nothing but let me fry one piece of bacon let me tell you okay one piece of bacon it's over the fire alarm is over you know i'm gonna put it in the oven now the first this first side is kind of like a little overcharged it's still good but still good but if i would have left it like a couple of moments later it would have been dead it'd have been over it'd have been disgusting it would have been charcoal it would have been <sighs> that was weird George says hello. Say hello, George. Look at the camera. Not at me. I right, fine. Hi. Oh, my baby. My baby. I'm going to have to wash my whole entire everything. Do you see yourself? No? No? Oh, my baby. Mm -hmm. You like his bow? It's 
gonna whine. I have them all over my face. I gotta, hold on. A cute, adorable cat. I kept the top of it and he's been like on it. He likes it. So the top of the little thing that was here, I kept it and he's just been on it. That's Georgie. And this is what it looks like. Sorry. Yep, this is it here. Look at Georgie. I am all showered and lotioned. Oh, I forgot to spray perfume. Okay, better. So I'm ready to go to bed, right? I'm ready to eat and go to bed. So I use this to grab it out of the oven, <laughs> the pork chops. And like a portion of it wasn't covered very well because like I tried to double it up. Anyway, long story short, I burnt my hand. Like just the palm of it, it's stinging now, but instantly, <laughs> instantly I'm over it. I don't want to eat pork chops no more. I want to eat ice cream. I kid you not. I'm gonna go to my refrigerator, fish out the strawberry ice cream in the back, and sit on my bed, watch some, I don't know, true crimes or something, which I realize I can only watch when I'm off the next day because it definitely gives me nightmares. Like I'm talking real nightmares, like you guys. So I can't, and I, and I thought, this is how it used to work for me, right? If I watch something scary, I have the counter balance with like something sweet, like kittens or something like that, or a kid's TV show where the bad guy <laughs> loses. Um, no, not anymore, still get nightmares. So, and I stay up for like a good two hours after I wake up from the nightmare. So, can't really go to work after that, can ya? So I'm watching true crimes, but let me show you. So this is a bag of um, this is a bag of frozen broccoli. This is how much it turned out to be. Just one bag. Here's the two pork chops, do do do, and then the potatoes that I put inside. But yeah, about to eat some roast. No, I'm actually not gonna eat it. Why am I lying to you? I do eat it. Honestly, this takes like a couple hours for my hunger to come back to me because I'm so upset with myself. Anyway, I'm going to end the vlog now. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And you guys will see me tomorrow when I upload another video. Later.